Look, here we go. I'm going to push this back a little bit without knocking it over, maybe, if I'm lucky. Oh. Oh, my gosh. Well, just to get everybody all warmed up, I'll open the Verizon bill. Oh. I think okay. that we are getting billed by Verizon for a bunch of stuff we don't have. Yes, by like internet service. Right. I, I, so I, one of my next chores when I have nothing to do is going to be to make a list of the, all the bills I have paid to Verizon. Because right now they're saying I'm, I'm overdue and going to get shut off. And I just paid one. And somehow they took $500 all by themselves with not much of my permission to do that. I actually have a suspicion that we have more than one Verizon bill that's coming I in. I think that's true. Because it shouldn't be anything like that. No. But, you know, another thing I found with Verizon, and this was a long time ago, mm -hmm. but if you turned your Verizon bill over, <laughs> it was a, they were billing for Joe's Smoke Shop, and they booked you bill, and there was a whole bunch of things that were not related to and, and Verizon. They were paying Verizon to send the bill out. Right. Come on. <laughs> you know? Accident number. See, here's a ballot due, $203. Hmm. Formal, look at it. will be discontinued. She said it's going to go immediately. What, what am I going to lose? I think I'm going to lose the phone. I'm not too upset about that. We don't have a phone line, do we? Huh? You don't use a phone line. I you have a... A mobile. But that's not... This is Verizon Home then, is it not? Well, my my, my phone is Verizon also. Uh-huh. And I think that's what this one is. Because it's only... It's only, what, $203. All oh, right, okay. She'll put that in the safe for Judy to look at file. She's away for a week. We'll maybe just look at it ourselves then. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it, it, I probably ought to do something about it. But I don't think I ought to pay it right. You know, I just... Right. We'll have to have a looky see. Hey, by the little lot of... Of course, maybe you know more about the Constitution than we do, but... No. I, when Biden says he's turning over the hands tonight or whatever, does that mean that he is no longer president as of now? I didn't even know he was doing that. I've been out all day. Well, that's what they've said. Are they? So he's handing over responsibility. Is that what he's doing? I don't know. They've made noises that I don't understand. No. I've not been watching anything. Right now it says Biden will not address the convention in Chicago. I see. No. I don't know. That's the benefit of being foreign. <laughs> <laughs> right. well, I have no idea. Oh, uh, me. Have you got any other bills? Well, we don't no. want bills. Yes, you do. Well, this is a bill. Is it a bill? Oh, I don't know. Oh, oh this one. Uh, yeah, it's this. from the vet. From the vet, that <laughs> sure is. Look at the quality, though. It's oh, nice. Nice envelope. Nice envelope. I can't get it open. I, did I not? Oh, I've got it. You got a thing? There we go. The glue goes all the way up to the top. Oh, that's a big expensive. quality quality glue. Quality envelope, <laughs> boy. Expensive. Yes. Because veterinarians are expensive, and they can buy. Thank you. Stuff like that. Look at the words, my lord. 
you we were there five minutes. Yes. Oh, here we go. They've already put it through my, oh, it's only 197. Cheap at the price. That, that, they put it through the thing already. Office call, canine, nothing. Office call, first puppy or kitten. Oh, that was bad. That'll be for your cat. <laughs> oh no, first your puppy. Puppy, puppy $75. Rabies, 29. Mm -hmm. DHPP series, 31. Mm -hmm. Lime, 1. And waste disposal, $5. Did you give her the um, Lyme vaccine? Apparently we did. Right. Uh, that was being discussed with Janine, who was there. Right, okay. And I was totally out of it. And in the process, somehow, I thought, where the hell's Larky? Which you took him. <laughs> and then, well, was, how can you lose a 200-pound dog? <laughs> Easy. I've, I've just gonna, you're just going to try hard. Oh, God. <laughs> so does that have her rabies certificate, then? Well, that's probably what the, one of these other pieces of paper is. Rabies certificate. Oh, that's perfect, because that needs you to be in the car. You want that one, too? Yes. Okay. But you know what we'll do? We'll take a copy of it. I hope so. And um, we'll put the copy out. That's what we'll do after we come off the, off the mail chat. Put that in, there. in an emergency, contact Woburn or Bulger. Yep. Yeah, um, I don't know whether that. Bella has completely taken over ZD, and I don't under. I, she's I, certainly doing a super job. She is doing a super job. She's got a hell of a dog out of it too. Yeah, right? she's lovely. She's enormous now. Yes. All right. Now, okay. Now that's a serious guy. Are we ready? Are you serious? I get a, uh, an email from a guy. He wants a, a service dog. Mm-hmm. And. He doesn't know where to go to get one. He doesn't know whether he could train his own. He basically needs it for balance and to cheer him up a bit. He's the mm. PTSD type thing. Well, that doesn't take an awful lot of training. Mm -hmm. You know? Mm -hmm. So why should I not say to the guy, you get a puppy and bring it over and I'll help you out. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's about what I'm going to do. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's not going to make a lot of people happy because there are a lot of people that are spending thirty, forty thousand dollars to raise one lousy dog. Yes. You got now. How much did I spend on ZD? <laughs> the biggest thing is the vet bill, about two hundred dollars. <laughs> yeah. Because and how much she... did I spend on pasta? Not less. <laughs> what was... Yeah. Yeah. Pastor's doing every bit as good a job. Yes, he's lovely. Yep, I tell you. So there's an awful lot of smoke and mirrors going on. Well, you know where he can go and source his dog as well if he wanted to. Who? Well, the same place you've got her, because they've got dogs coming up. I can't hear. That... The, the kennel where you got her have dogs coming up. Puppies coming up ready, I oh, think, yeah. in September. Oh, yeah. You know, so you know where he can find a dog if he wants to have a dog to yeah. start the training process with. Yeah. Can you hear what people will say about that? Oh, I can only imagine. <laughs> I have a very... Why should I not be able to? Because I know I'm qualified. Well, you know what... Not qualified? Well, but... What do you mean, well? The stupid thing about it is, is that isn't it better... For him, if he's got the inclination, isn't it better for him to have the support to develop the dog that he wants? Yeah. I can see both sides of it. You know, people want a dog ready to go straight into it, and that's fine. But if he's interested in working with the dog and being part of the training It'll process... Take care of the PTSD part of it. Well, I, th I think it certainly does, and it gives him a, a tremendous relationship with that yeah. dog. Yeah. I think I would always prefer to be on the training side alongside the dog as opposed to be presented with a dog that had 
you know, been yeah. fully, but that's, but I'm able-bodied, sort of, and, um, <laughs> and uh, you know, interested in that, you know. Yeah. So I think it's, it's something to be encouraged. Well, I, I, in my mind, I've put out two dogs. Ah. So far. So, but, but, but the lovely thing would be working with someone else and their dog. I know. I know. And potentially those two could work alongside each other. Miss Whatever. Penny, you know, you can have yeah, them. Whatever. They'll be at the, roughly the same. I'm just checking in case that was your dinner. Hold on. Was it no, Monday? It's not. It's Nick. <laughs> is it Monday? Yes, it's Monday. Was that where I get dinner? Yeah, I know. That's why we were all excited. Hey. Okay. Oh, it was just Nick. Um, but that's interesting. It's interesting. I don't know where he lives. Maybe he lives in Chicago and can't. At which point, that's slightly tricky. But it, you know, you've he, helped people. If over local, the... Is there somebody local who wants to work on a dog? I'll, I'll help him. I don't... Did you not have some... buy my coffee? But did you not have somebody who you helped over the phone with a dog? Oh yeah. You did. Yeah. Because you've done that for several people. And then, and then there's what's her name with one on each side, Sandy. Yeah. Yeah. And she's working well with a dog on each side. I know. And she could not work with just one. Mhm. Mm Sorry. Well, but everybody's an individual. I know. I I can see that. But the mm -hmm. ADI fits them everybody into one little. You know, you've got to spend six months training the dog to walk in a straight line. I mean, give me a break. Yeah. Well. It's an interesting concept, yeah, and not without you know the realms oh, of. Oh, I know, because you, because you got a whole lot of bunch of idiots like me. Oh well, yeah, but then <laughs> again, the beauty, but then the beauty of it is, is that people would have, you know, if they're really truly interested, they have, would have dogs that are one hundred percent brought up through yeah. their life. Right. <coughs> I think the. The kicker in the whole thing is, I do it for nothing. Mm -hmm. If somebody says, you give me $10,000, I'll make you a dog. Mm -hmm. Well, I suppose I could manage to do that too. <laughs> Basically, I, 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 I don't charge, but I, coffee and things is very nice, but I don't, etc. So are you keeper of the paper? I'm going to hold on to that just now. Well, you know, it's, it's a really interesting thing because I think sometimes, you know, a lot of it's very intuitive. And I go to a training class with Annie because Annie's beyond my pay scale because she's a totally and utterly different energy That's level. That's a different dog. It's a totally different dog, but I understand exactly where I'm going with the training class. And it's only going to be three classes, but what it does is it reinforces what I should be doing. And that's what you would be doing with that person is yeah. re-establishing re the first steps to yeah. build upon, and and that's important. Canine good citizens. Uh huh. Exactly. Is really what you want to start with. Yeah. Okay, so when I'm driving around in the middle of the night, or not, not really. No, you're not driving around in the middle of the night. No, but I'm thinking, <laughs> and I'm wondering why do your dogs bark? Mine, because they bark at those dogs down there. No, why? Sometimes they're not barking. No, they it's all there, or another dog goes past outside them, or the goats. They also don't like the goats. But not all the dogs bark. That's that's what I'm okay. Why it's, why don't they? Because it's it's not in their nature. They're not barky dogs. But I have a German Shepherd, the young one, the very young one, and she lets me know about everything that is happening and she's highly excited and she thinks it's the best thing ever because i have situations around here where not everybody barks yeah and i'm kind of studying the wolf wolf mm -hmm. as opposed to the wolf 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 mm -hmm. there's twos and threes that are definitely different barks and i ha also i have a great dane my blue great dane yeah and if she thinks she's been left behind, that dog would bark non-stop. Well, that, that's a different story. Yeah. She's incessant. <laughs> that's a great thing for you. Yeah. You don't leave them behind. No, you don't. Well, it, no, we don't. Mm -hmm. But even if you pop her away in the bedroom for 20 minutes while you're, you know, moving things round about, yeah. she'll sit in there for 20 minutes and bark. Yeah. It's interesting. And... and and how, 
what what is the the sequence of the barking? Uh -huh. I I can't tell what your what your dog, but there's a definite sequence here. Yeah. And mostly it's twos and threes. Yeah. I can hear them just now, and it's because they're they're getting ready to eat. I think. I can't hear them at all. Maybe that's why I think it's only your dog barking. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. It's not mine because mine are all inside that much I do know. Huh? <laughs> it's not mine because they're all inside just now. <laughs> okay. That's why you're so... a dog bark inside? No. Well, one of them does upstairs because she sat, stands at the upstairs window and watches what's going on outside. And if there's anything interesting, she's like, hold on, I better let you. And you're like, oh, here we go. Here we go. But they don't bark at night time. I don't know. Janine says they bark all the time. No, they, bark, they don't bark at night time. They go to sleep. Oh, really? Yeah. And they, do you know who they really don't like is Wanda? Because oh. you know how Wanda, yes. she just parades back in front of them and goes, da, 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 da. And they're like, Rah! <laughs> She is afraid of Penny. Is she? She is. I mean, that's, what this, that's what this towel was. We had it on both sides of the handles uh -huh. and her in the middle. Oh yes, it, it, it was interesting. That's not like Wanda. No, it's not. She snapped at her a couple times, mm -hmm. and that that does back her off. But she thinks it's games. And then, you know, yeah. um, and she doesn't realize it wasn't Chomp, but she poor Wanda, you know. So we have to kind of play that one down a little bit. <laughs> oh, that must be a first for Wanda, because she's normally yeah. In the dominant dog, isn't she? Yeah, she is. She comes in here. She's afraid. Yeah. She's afraid. And I tell her to get in the chair, and she gets in that chair. Yeah. Um, and then she looks at me like, is this right? <laughs> you know, what do I do next? You know? Well, look at yeah. that. Penny, Penny's the first dog to have trained Wanda. Right. <laughs> Interesting. Because that's, that's not like her. No, and, my, and the other thing is, when I'm outside with the dogs, they're quite happy just... They wander around with you, the boom, boom, boom. But then Janine came strolling up with Penny. She was training Penny in the driveway. And they were like, uh-oh, intruder alert. And they're going, woof, 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 woof. Really? Yeah. Huh. Beyond excite exciting. That's interesting. And I can tell you, they all bark at dinner time when the deer go out. Oh. Yeah, because they'll see the deer. You know the deer that go down at dinner yeah. time? They're like, uh-oh, deer. <laughs> Let's Mad. Let's open this and yes. show everybody. Can you use... Oh, you didn't do Jan's letter. You didn't do Jan's. I didn't do Jan's. We can do that after that. Have you got the... Here. I got nothing. Ah. I, my shoulder. Uh, you're only allowed to play, complain about one... Thing. Ailment at a time around here, I was told very politely the other day. That, that's a very good rule, mind you. Um, I am a little stiff from pulling weed. Oh. Oh. Yes, I pull too many weeds. Thank you, Chad. And you got that one. Thank you, you very much. One, and you can have that one. I have that. Thank you. French fries are consumed outside of the home 90% of the time. Hmm. I believe it. You mm -hmm. can't French fry anything. Two oh, out of three people think bacon should be a national food. Well, Is it not? <laughs> right. Goodness. 90% of people who, who went to the movies said they would visit Juris Parla, if it was Jurassic real? Park. Oh. They would visit Jurassic Park if it was real. Oh, okay. Okay, that's a very high percentage because I don't think I would. Thank you, Jan. Okay. Well, this is to me. Yes. I've only got this just now. Will that help you? It doesn't work. But you can't make that work every time. Yes, you can. No, I can't. Look Stop at that. it in the middle. Not that middle. <laughs> Stab it in the middle there. There? Yeah. There you go. Wiggle Got it back and forward. There you go. Okay. Now do you want to help me with yeah. the next one? Stab it in the middle. 
helpful, actually. <laughs> no need. <laughs> oh, we've got another box. Yeehaw! <laughs> oh, here we go. <laughs> okay. It's the, the Russian doll boxes. More box. Oh, biohazards. Biohazard. That's me all over. Oh, look. Funny. Oh, that's Does it go that way? I'm trying. Because that's its mailing box, isn't it? Well, that part should come apart, right? Come up the way. Oh, it should come apart there. And it doesn't. What's up? Oh, don't rip it. Don't rip it. No, it's it's, it. it's got to come out of there. There we go. Keep this box. <laughs> Yeah, after, right there, after, it tells me. Keep, keep this box after we've pulled it apart. <laughs> this is your purpose prepaid return box. Mm. See, that's what I mean about these people. <laughs> this is Dupixon, isn't it? Yeah, it's Dupixon. This is the Dupixon. That where is if I were paying for it, it would be seven thousand a month. Yes. I can see why. Okay, this is how you make a box. You want to do that some more? Ooh. Okay. Sharps box. How you make a box. Well, oh, there we go. That, that's all made. Look that's that. perfect. Yeah. So now we just have to make sure we don't lose this. But you only use it every two weeks, is that right? Yeah. Right, okay. 15 days. That's two weeks left. I know. Why are you putting it back in the bag? I'm just keeping it tidy. Because <laughs> we're going to have to keep it with the box so we don't lose the box. No, because what you can do with it is take it to the police station after you... Right, so we maybe just up. get rid of the box then. I have a feeling we're not going to be around that long. No, we'll lose the box. Let's be Here, realistic. This is how you do a box. Oh, wow. What's, What's that say? They've ever even given a sticky what label. It, it does. What's it say? I can't see what it says. It says sharps on that. And that, I think, is just blank. I think this is a sticky label. God, they've given us the sticky to close it down and everything. You've got to be kidding me. Yeah, we should really use it because, quite frankly, that's a masterpiece. I, I, I wonder if they're going to call and see whether I've I know exactly <laughs> why we haven't sent it. Have you stuck it down your whatever? <laughs> oh, for God's sakes, this is in French or something. All right, so that's not going to work. This is one gallon sharp box. <sighs> System components. Tape, twist ties, and instructions. Manifest tracking document on the outside of the box. Yes. Do not mail this container in any box other than the one supplied. Maybe we keep the box. Training in his instructions. <laughs> right. For Is, use of the box. What did we do with the previous needle? Huh? Where did we put the previous needle? I don't, I hate to think where we put them. <laughs> We're supposed to take them to the police station. It's probably huh? in the medicine box. Outer white shipping box. In a box lined with four milliliter plastic bag and one gallon sharps collection container. With absorbent pad. See? Twist tape. Tape, twist tie, and instructions. Yeah. The twist tie is for this because it says, please keep the bag. <laughs> this is a recipe. I just can't win. <laughs> Here, do you read French? Yes. Do I have to know what it means, though? <laughs> so basically, we shall be twist tying the bag... Bag. Before we place it in the in box the and sealing it with the tape, yawn plastic tape. 
You should keep the instructions in the bag with everything else, I think, quite frankly, because this is a bit, this is going to be a bit much. By the time I have taken four or five of these shots every two weeks, we will have lost a little box. Uh, that's what I'm worried about. And everything, and it'll end up going to the police station. Yes. As long as they're not uh, part of your process, isn't that we have to return the used sharps? Oh, I never thought about that. Yes. These are very interesting needles. I have never seen needles like that. Have you seen the needle? No. Oh, well, you take the end of it off, uh -huh. and it doesn't look like anything at all. You put it on your leg, uh -huh. and you push down, and you don't have to go about that far, uh -huh. and it goes in you, uh -huh. and this whole thing, and, and, and it's gone. Uh -huh. But it's, it's only, it's, it's very short, very, I can't, I can't get all excited about the needle. It's only about that long. Totally. And do you feel it? Huh? Do you feel it? Oh, I feel it, yeah. Is it sore? No, it's not bad. No. This is a very special box, bag, and... Uh, biohazard. Biohazard. Although we haven't got any biohazards in it quite yet. Still time. Jesus. Yeah. And you know what's going to happen next... No, no, no. Next, what is next about time you now? take your shot... What? Next time you take your shop, we'll be like, where's that bloody bag with that box and that red thing? We had one. It's right up there. Is it right up there? The white thing? Or did Judy find something to do with it? No. No. Right there. What's that? That's pens. Pens. That's what it looks like. <laughs> no. I don't she think must have put it back in the refrigerator. If you want, yeah. we really want to look at it, they're probably, right together. It's probably still with the other ones, yeah? Um, in the drawer on the... Right, right. Uh, on the left hand side. Yeah, maybe. not the snack drawer. Well, it's with the snacks. <laughs> oh, God. I don't think this is the first box. No, that's one I haven't used, but I can show you. I can show it to you. We'll pop that back in. We'll look at that before you do it. We'll be back. Oh, I don't want to open it in case we. Contaminate it because that would not be cool. Oh, exciting start to the week. Who? Exciting start to the week. Oh, exciting! I, I, I want to watch this. This, I would not go to this convention for all the tea in China because if ever there's going to be a bomb set off or whatever, <laughs> oh goodness! You yeah, know, I suppose in this kind of a deal. Yeah, nobody fancies that. Nor would I run for president. No, that's Nor a terrible would they want job. me to run for president. I think it would be the most awful job. It's okay. You get this job, and all of a sudden, you are on a ten-minute schedule. They wake you up, get you dressed. You got you got somebody that you have an attendant. He gets you all dressed and perfect. Everything matches, and they put you out, and you're right in front of the microphone. You're da 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 for five minutes and then you're off again to the next one. And then in between, everybody criticizes what you That's say. Right. What you said. Because you'll never be right anyway. Right. Everybody. Yeah. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a Facebook gone wrong. It is. <laughs> it's Facebook on steroids. There you go. <laughs> right. Yes, it is possible to fix the thermometer on the big tree. And I did actually look at it yesterday and I realized that the attachment at the top um, was totally missing. So I need to go and get the ladder. And yesterday when I, when I, I thought what about is this? you know the big thermometer that's on the tree? Oh, yeah. Yeah, well, um, it's been knocked. And so it's hanging, it's, it's, been it's hanging down like this. But the attachment that was in the tree is totally missing. And yesterday, while I was thinking about it, um, one of the goats was like, yeah, you want to come in and stand on my back and I'll help? And I'm like, no. <laughs> and now am I standing on a ladder with those blinking goats in there? Because I know what happens. <laughs> So I will send Nick. Okay. Uh, Penny is lying down there. Let me see. Is she there? Oh, that's so sweet. She's actually. Oh, that's really sweet. Look at her. <laughs> Hang on a minute. Let me see if I can get her. Look at her. She's turkeyed. Have I done that properly? Oh, you're a wee sweetheart. Absolutely wiped out. She's been out, Janine's had her out training and she's been a super duper star all day. The dog that is.
is not she anymore. She does now sit. She does. The finger. Yes, she does not know. Don't bother sitting. You yes. know what I mean? Now she won't no. stop it. Yes. <laughs> is this what gets me food? Yes. <laughs> She's like boom. Um, I don't know if you can take these to the pharmacy. I don't know if there's something in them that they're... The pharmacy? Yeah, they'll take them. Yeah, will they take them as well? Anybody who sells stuff has to take it back. back. Um, no, all the dogs are inside. No, they're barking. Yeah, they're being fed, and mine are thinking they'll get fed too. Hold on, let me see. Arlo! Okay, apparently Arlo was barking. <laughs> Yeah, Janine's coming. So you see Arlo is outside wagging his tail and he's like, it's Janine! Well, oh, Janine is coming up here. And she's got two men with her, so I don't know what she's doing. Um, do we show up tomorrow? The thinnest thing. Yeah, but she goes all the time. She does eat. She does. I, I don't know. Uh, have you got the wound clinic tomorrow? What? Have you got the wound clinic tomorrow? Oh no, that was last week. What day are we on? Yes, you've got Hunt. There's Hunt tomorrow morning and the Wound Clinic at nine. Okay, so I got the Wound Clinic and then I got Hunt. Yeah. Hunt's at ten? Yeah, that's perfect. Is what, what is it, Hunt? Equines. So you can go to the Wound Clinic on your horse and then just pop well, on by. Well, Janine can take Wanda and I don't have to go at all. <laughs> this is true. Uh, I do want to go though because there is a huge rehab hospital connected to Hunt. Is that the one that's across the road? Yeah. 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 The one that, because they all came out the last time. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they were super. You rattle off everything you know about one particular topic, don't you? <laughs> it's, the only, it's the only time, well, I've been to Hunt once with you and I've been Hunt with Janine. But I wasn't finished telling oh, my sorry. story. <laughs> I know, I forgot what I was going to say anyway. Well, I actually have real problems working out which place is which. Because I haven't been often enough. Oh, well, I know which, I know which building to go in. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't stretch my imagination too much. <laughs> and um, Bud did a really good job fixing the door. He did. It works now. It took him forever. Oh, what was wrong with it? It didn't work. Yeah, but there wasn't anything... Uh, no, that's a whole new mecha mechanism. Oh, right. Um, and he had trouble with it not shutting at all. Yeah, I know. Blowing do. open. <laughs> oh, that's even worse. Right. <laughs> yes, I think we are. I thought it was going to have to be like Ann Getchell. <laughs> I know, with the, with the, the, with big, the, two by four. the big two by four, that's right. Hold the door shut. <clears throat> okay. Well, then at least we would know you were inside. That's true. Yes. Um... But you wouldn't know where the dogs were. No, we wouldn't. <laughs> yes, so Bud did a really good job fixing the door yesterday. And I, and I think we'll probably return the container that they provided for us because it's been a lot of work getting that. Mutter, 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 mumble. Do you want your headphones? Where are your headphones? I don't know where your headphones are. I had them. I had them going earlier. Where did you put them? I, I, I got them going to make sure I was going to be able to hear for this. This hot, this whatever. Oh, look, there they are. Oh, there they are. Right there. Look, on the handy hook. <laughs> and there's your glasses. There are my glasses. Is that working? Is it on? What? <laughs> <laughs> that worked really well. <laughs> okay, we'll try that. Is it switched on, yeah? It's on. Is it on? Yeah. Okay. I don't know where the other part is. I have no idea either. It's taken. It's down there somewhere. It fell off somewhere. Oh, there it is. Ah, there it is. It. Oh, that's perfect. Go hey. ahead, talk. Okay, that's fine. Oh, and it is definitely Monday, which is good. Um, and that gets my food. I get a dinner. Does it? For town. Yeah, from, from the town. That's right. Yes. Isn't this fun? It's total fun. Now you can hear everything. <laughs> Not necessarily true. Oh, it's a full moon. Is that tonight? 
According to NASA, a moon is considered a supermoon when it's in its new or full phase and within 90% of its closest approach to Earth. But since new moons aren't easy to see as a full moon, we tend to pay more attention to the full moon version. I had noticed that last week the moon was very orange. Did you notice no. that? No. No. Well, that's because it was about nine o'clock at night. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, right, so here you are for you. Um, Biden is still president, apparently. He's just giving Kamala his blessing and support. Oh. There. Okay. We all love Wanda. You need to get to the back of the queue, Roger. Okay. Oh, so, and there's another bit. He's handing over the nomination to her. So she'll take on yeah. whatever's uh, voting. And he will remain president until January 2025. That's what I thought. Yes. Well, Penny's exhausted because Janine had her out about three o'clock up and down the driveway training. Yes. Oh, that's Amazon. I know. Um, oh my gosh, what's happening in November? Is Roger coming to us to steal Wanda? Wow. Apparently, your hair looks lovely. Really? Yes, it's because you've got your curls in. Wow. Mm. Does your needle attach to a pen filled with your medication? Is that how it works? That's a pretty weird deal, though. Yeah, and then apparently Dodie's, Dodie's insulin med is, is uses the same system. Then she dials to the number of the dosage that she takes. Right, yeah. Um, then she sticks herself till the dial goes to zero. Yeah. Then take the needle off and dispose of. Mine, my watch a bubble come down and it all turns orange, yeah, yellow. Oh, yours colored. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, D. And then I'm supposed to count to five and then I can take the needle off my legs. Oh, <laughs> there's instructions for everything. That's right. <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> you can complain about your wrist if you like. It's only one body part a day, though, Michelle. That's true. Yeah, you're not allowed anything other than your wrist until tomorrow. One, one ailment a day. One ailment. It is a full moon today. Ooh. And apparently it's a rare blue super moon. You seen one, you I'll see them all. I'll set my alarm then. and get up and look at it. I like your hair back. <laughs> yes, it's less, it's less crazy because it's very humid. I had, a, I had a rule around here when I was running the joint that mm. if it touched your shoulders, you had to put it in a, in a bum. Ooh. Because it's, it's a danger thing. I mean, mm -hmm. you know, you use some of these tools around here. I did go shopping today, though. <laughs> did you hear about the lady with the, with the grinder? Oh, did her hair get out? And then her head? Yes. Ugh. Yes, she was she was trimming nails and she had long hair and then a couple of hairs got caught in it. And it caught her hand in such a way that it stayed on the button. <gasps> and it came up and it screwed right into her face, had a hell of a mess. Oh. So there you are. Like doing fingernails. Huh? Fingernails. What? Or she was grinding fingernails or dogs. Oh, the dogs. The dogs. <laughs> the dog's nails. But it got, you know, it got it up in her face. Yeah. So there. Yeah. Besides, you know, long hair, long hair in animals is not necessarily a good thing. Yeah. But they do make very good, funny shampoo nowadays. To do what? To wash your hair with. Yeah, I only do that every five days. I can't be bothered. <laughs> you can guarantee as soon as I've washed my hair, I either get spat on by an alpaca, yeah. something sneezes on me. So I think, yeah. does it look like rain? I'll do it tomorrow. <laughs> so I get to at least five days. Okay. Now... 
so that I'm going to have dinner. So she's going to buy me dinner tonight. Yes. Which will be very tasty. It's always interesting to see what they bring. It was okay last time. It was a yeah. piece of corn. Who? And a hamburger. Was it? Just a, like, a plain burger with salad, and they've always got salad. The, 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 the hamburger. Uh, that's not bad. That's not bad. And salad. And Janine's all excited because she started putting the oven on to, to put your whatever it's in. And I said, it's Monday and the dinner comes today. She's like, right. She said, so it's back in the fridge for tomorrow. Ah, <laughs> uh, oh dear. It's always, it's always exciting on a Monday. Unless it's a holiday, at which, they, at which point they expect us to be to be in observance of holidays yes. and not wanting to eat. Yes. But that doesn't uh. happen here. So, that's us. Um, just waiting for dinner and uh, we'll be back tomorrow with, a, with another wrapping on your leg, I think. No. <laughs> I'm gonna fall Are you going to sleep again? Yeah. That book I read, they, they, they call this problem sort of a bobblehead. Right, that's me. <laughs> we have to get a bobblehead with my head face on it. <laughs> <laughs> I just won't go on. Oh, dear. That's, that's, it, it, I've had it my whole life, though, because that's why I never became a physics major, because physics lab was at 2 o'clock in the afternoon, and I knew I never could manage a lab at two o'clock in the afternoon. Literally, it's a college, you know. <laughs> um, so I just stuck with math. <laughs> oh joy! <laughs> oh joy! But that's why, you know. <sighs> at least I could get a good nap in. <laughs> well, yeah, that's true. Right. So we're all organised here. I think we're going to put our box in a very safe spot, which we'll promptly forget about. <sighs> that's always a worry. So, we'll see everybody tomorrow. Oh, okay. Bye. Bye.